So CJ posted a YouTube video titled, Kamari is coming out here for the summer. Now in this video, he did try to clear up the situation that has been going on between Jalea and Kamari. It. That hypothetical question, stop running it through the mud. Yes, we made mistakes by saying that Jalea wasn't talking about Kamari. She was talking about Kamari, all right? She most definitely was, her and her friend. But guess what? They were hypothetically speaking. I'm not gonna say, but they were just playing. No, 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 no. They were hypothetically speaking. They're not gonna do anything, okay? Some of the comments said things like, I can't believe he's making excuses for those other kids over his own child. Wow. And she still doesn't feel comfortable and I wouldn't force her. She only coming because it's court ordered, I heard. The fact that you justified her and her friends saying that about Kamari, it wasn't in Jalea's friend's place to even feel comfortable to say that about your real daughter. Other people also mentioned some other comments that CJ made in this video about Kamari. And even when Kamari was conceived, I'm not gonna lie, I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready for a kid, you can ask her mom. I told her, I'm like, hey, look, man, you better go do something. And she didn't listen to me, she had the kid anyway. So, so the comments were saying things like, the comment she had the kid anyway really explains everything about CJ. Someone else says, at 1225 is where you should realize you're giving us and Kamari that vibe you didn't want her. I'm definitely not defending anyone or taking any sides here, but CJ has stated this before. I mean, he even said that about the twins. If you guys don't remember, he said, royalty wanted the kids not really him so you guys know cj just talks and says a little bit too much sometimes and i get that he's trying to fix the situation between jalea and kamari to make kamari feel comfortable coming out basically by saying like hey look they're not going to touch you they didn't mean anything by it they were just speaking hypothetically but i think it would have been better to have jalea admit to her mistakes and apologize on her and the friend's behalf have but anyways that's just my opinion on that whole situation let me know what you guys think about that down in the comment section below now in a video that i posted yesterday i did state lauren blasted joelle again for allegedly cheating so she did comment under that video and she stated he makes me sick but won't leave me alone but at this point lauren should know that she's going to be the one to have to officially end this because joelle is just going to drag this out as long as he can. I mean, they have three kids together. But anyways, on to the next topic. Queen Nyja did go onto Instagram and she posted, my next song gonna have a lot of men upset heads up and i'm definitely excited to hear this i actually really love queen's music i feel like she is so underrated and she deserves to be so much further i believe her last album was a complete bop and you can play it from start to finish so i'm really hoping this next project does it for her but anyways let me know what you guys think about this and everything else in this video down in the comment section below i to work on Letting y'all mind be stronger than y'all feelings. Y'all have to understand we was taught feelings. The reason why we was taught feelings, it was the way to control us and how we felt. Y'all don't remember when we had the little pot charts when we was younger, the happy, this is you when you happy. This is the face you make when you sad. This is when you surprised. This is when you scared. And even us, we make the happy face, baby. Those are all, it's all a way of controlling and manipulation. You shouldn't have to teach us something naturally that we do. Even when the baby comes out the mother's womb, it automatically knows to suck on the breast. You feel me? Even when, you know, you don't got to teach a child to blink. You don't. You feel me? Why do they do this? Why do they teach us these things? This is a way to control us. Imagine if we never knew what sad was or happy was. Why y'all think if y'all don't send your kid to school, y'all go to jail? I gotta understand this. I gotta really ask. I gotta really just rethink and ask yourself everything that they taught us. If they lied to us about full outages, lied to us about this, what more did they lie to us about? So that's something you gotta ask yourself. Like, damn, is this true? Is this true? What about this? What about this? You feel me? That's why if you don't take your kids to school, you go to jail? Like, what sense does that make? That's because they've been training us and manipulating us our whole life. I'm telling y'all, this is true. Y'all can think I'm crazy, whatever, but this is this listen to what I'm saying, you feel me? Go back and do some research on it.
you know, look for yourself. Don't just believe anything somebody tell you. Go do research on yourself, you feel me?